All right. So we got Pitt minus 10 at Western Michigan. The total on this one's a 47 and a half. What do you got going on here? What's up, everybody? Don't forget about our new sponsor, Caesars Sportsbook. They're giving you up to $1,250 in a risk-free first bet and 1,000 Caesars reward points and 1,000 Caesars tier credits. This is big time value for all new accounts. All you got to do is download the app onto your phone and use the promo code MORNINGFUL or check out the description of the video and click on the link. Both teams come into this game one and one. <laughs> On the year, uh, they both they both had a game where they looked good and a game where they looked bad. Um, <clears throat> Pitt Pitt beat uh, West Virginia in Week One, and then they fell to Tennessee uh, last week in overtime. Western Michigan got smacked by Michigan State, and then they beat Ball State. I uh, I really like Pitt here, even on the road. You know, Pitt Pitt. Um, was a top tier team in the ACC last year. They're still ranked, and if they're going to make a make a move to get up higher, they're not going to make the playoffs. You know, like that's out. It's already out. It's right. for them, but it's already out. I don't think anybody from the ACC is going to make the playoffs. But um, Pitt has to make their move now if they want to get into bigger ball games. If they want to have a chance at the prestigious like a New Year's Six type thing, um, I think Pitt's going to control this game. Pitt has a pretty good defense. Um, they have the better athletes. They had the deeper team. They had the more talented team. I think uh, Pitt is pissed. They lost that game last week. They had a lot of chances to win that game. Yeah, they they should have won that game. And I think they're going to take it out on Western Michigan and get their second win of the year by uh, probably a couple of touchdowns at least to cover this 10 point number. Do you have a, see, my thing is 70% of the cash is on Pitt and the line's just sticking at that 10. So that kind of makes me nervous. Uh, do you have any feelings on the total? Because it's been a huge move to the under from 55 and a half to a 47 with 64% of the cash on the under. Any feelings on that? Is it Has it gone too far down and now we just take it over or are you just laying off the total entirely? I'm, I'm going to stay off the total entirely. Um, you know, these two teams are both one and one, but three out of the four games have busted 60 points and pushed 70 points you know, have pushed 70 right. points twice. So that under is quite He's strange. Uh, yeah. Both teams are giving up 32 a game. Pitt's scoring 32 a game. So it makes – it's weird to me too and stuff like that. I don't like it. I yeah. don't like – those numbers are weird looking to me and I just don't like it. So I'm just going to stick with the with the side and go with that. That's just it, like pushing 70 and it's down to a 47. It's very, very fishy to me. Very fishy. People stay off of that total. We're going to play Pitt minus the 10. If you're looking for Cam Ross's best bets, he's hitting about 75% right now. So he's making some money himself. Head over to picksandparlays.net and use the promo code NFL to save you 20% off of Cam's best bets. Also, everyone, let's like and subscribe. Ring the bell for notifications.